Okay. This is Sealer Tortillas, Sealer Moon News, Reviews, and I don't know what. Hey Moonies, today we're going to talk about the brand new Proplica from Bandai and Tamashi Nations. This literally just came out and I'm so excited to show it to you. Also, I have some fun Sailor Moon candy that I'm going to try later. I got these from Anime Osaka and it was super cool they could give me candy because that's always hard to get. Also, I always get annoyed when the tape gets stuck to my finger when I open these things. Please be mindful of it. Here it is, it comes wrapped in this wonderful tissue paper that you know is gonna protect the box and not let it get any scratches. Us collectors really need everything to be in mint condition. I love the holographics on this thing. This box is a lot larger than the other compact proplicas that we've gotten. Here's a beautiful image of the inside. This one brings a stand. And of course, all the proplicas have this flavor text on it. If you wanna pause and read that, that's cool. There's a cool silhouette of Super Sailor Moon on here. This one, remember, is going to have the sounds from the movies. Also, here's the Toei sticker. That's how you know it's authentic. So far, they haven't really made bootlegs of the Proplicas, but anyway, you're going to have to open up three different pieces of tape here. One, two, three, before you get that sucker open. This is going to be out in the U.S. at some point, but if you want it right now, you can just order it from Anime Osaka. That's how I got mine so quickly. Look at this beautiful silhouette. And, oh, okay, the instructions are not hidden on this one. They're not like hiding underneath, so I'll just open it up. Here's some info about Sailor Moon Eternal and the inspiration for the transformation sequence, as well as info on the song single. These instructions do have an English translation, but I did notice that they were missing some information. Here it says that there's two songs, the single from the movie Shine On and the theme from the original show, but the English translation just says theme music. It doesn't tell you that there's two songs, but I'm telling you guys, there are two songs that will play on this toy. I love that you can see it right when you open the box. It's kind of floating in there. I didn't realize at first that it had a plastic, but here you go. It comes with a cool little stand. Um, some of these have stands, some of these don't. When they originally showed this, they showed it with a stand that actually holds Chibiusa's brooch. I don't know if that's something that's gonna come out or they just scrapped it, but at some point there was a version of this with a stand that will hold two brooches. Pretty cool. I really do hope they still come out with that. It also has little holes for the speakers and you'll see planetary symbols on the side. Very nice little details that you'll only notice up close. If they ever do make bootlegs of these, they may not actually have those. And you've got speaker holes so you can play the music while it's sitting on your desk or in your collection. Of course, I do love that they put it in plastic to stop the evil paint scratch issues, which is kind of a thing with Bandai. But looking at this really closely, I'm not seeing a lot of paint defects in this shiny gold paint, so I'm already pretty happy with what I see. I see some little specks, but no real scratches, not like the Polly Pocket toy that came out. It has the same brooch design if you want to check that out. That's a review here on my channel. It's got this smooth, smooth crown. It's beautiful. It feels really good in hand, and in full transparency, I didn't think I was going to like this this much because it has Sailor Moon Eternal sounds, but oof, you are in for a treat. There's two buttons on this, one's on the back. Uh, that one's gonna play music while it's in closed mode. And on the inside, you'll notice these beautiful rainbow colors. It's got a mirror just like everything else. I noticed a little thing there on the bottom left, um, but it was only attached to the protective plastic. You'll see in a second, I'm just gonna remove that sucker because I wanna see my face. I don't want it to be blurry. And the collectors cried. Oh yes, yes, let's make faces. That's not a button, that's a button. That is the button. So if you think that the silver crystal is gonna do anything for you, it's not. Here I am opening the back of the battery compartment so that I can make sure that it is activated and ready to play beautiful sounds. Here's the inside. You'll see that there's an A and B switch. On the other Proplicas, usually there's different sounds associated with A and B. On this one, A is quiet mode and B is loud mode. So we're gonna remove this tab and we're gonna start having fun with the sounds on this thing. And that's the second button. And you'll be using, well, let's, let's do A mode so you can kind of see the quiet sounds. They're very quiet.
Oh, but it turns off if I close it. Ooh, and it when I open it, open, close. It's kind of cool. Yeah, that was kind of cool. It was actually kind of cool. Oh, shit. No one finished what you were saying. Oh, that's, oh, that's loud. Okay, it's more of the same. Got it. Here I tried to hold the button down to see if it had a secret mode. Turns out it doesn't, and neither does the back button. B mode is just loud. Yeah, if you open it, the music stops, which is weird.
Am I the only one annoyed that Osagi just only talks about Mamo-chan? She's got other friends, you know. Whatever. It's besides the point. Next. <laughs> okay. You just sit yourself right there. I wish this would stand up a little better. I'm gonna rub off those fingerprints. More like this, but that's okay. This is pretty nice. I hope you enjoyed this look at the brand new Sailor Moon Proplica from Sailor Moon Eternal. This is the first time we've seen a Crisis Brooch Proplica. There were kind of like looking like rumors like we were gonna get a second version of the Chibiusa brooch. But so far, nothing. Um, I do think that this is very unique compared to the other Proplicas because it does have that closed mode versus an open mode. What do you guys think? Again, I didn't think I was going to like this this much because I was like, no, the Sailor Moon Eternal sounds, they don't really resonate with me. I like the classic stuff. But that inclusion of the classic theme song really made my day. And I think that the loud mode is loud enough. I think that there's really good paint quality on this one. I'm super surprised. You know, I'm super critical of these. Um, but if you want it, Anime Osaka has it right now. And, you know, I just get everything from them, including that candy that I guess I'll be tasting on TikTok since I ran out of time for this video. But make sure you follow my TikTok for some fun, moony jokes and creative things. Um, <laughs> Sailor Moon talk is kind of crazy. So yeah, I'm Sailor Tortilla, and thank you for checking out this video. I'll see you next time.